Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode and in this video I am going to talk about how to fix your iPhone is not charging after iOS 15 update or are having trouble while charging your iPhone and how you can fix this app. So the issue can be internally as well as external issues. So the, we're going to talk about one of these few steps which you can try out on your phone internally which is you have to do a force restart. So the first thing is force restart so you can do by pressing horn volume up followed by volume down button press and hold power button and listen until you see the apple logo on the home screen once it is done you have to check whether you are having the trouble and if you are having the trouble then most probably you are supposed to move to the next solution so the next solution is all about this can happen due to many reasons and one of the reason is so moving on to the next solution is all about if your iphone is overheating and if you felt so then most probably most in scenarios people go and plug the charger to charge it up so this is going to make the issue more worse so i request when the phone is overheating you just have to make it cold that means you have to keep your iphone at least for uh, you know half an hour or one hour unless and until it's get cooled down and after that try charging your iphone okay and moving on done with this even if it's not fixing you don't have to worry we have two more solutions the next solution is make sure the, you are charging your iphone by removing the case as you can see i'm having the case over here so you have to remove the case and you have to charge it uh, charge the iphone and see whether the issue is solved and if it's not working then most probably we have to move to the next solution so next solution is all about you have to check the charging port of your iphone most probably the issue can or happen over here due to some of the dirts as well as some dust particles it will be over here so you just have to clean your charging port and once you clean the charging port you have to connect with the chargers and see whether the issue is solved or not and also parallelly with this i would like to make a suggestion that do not use a second copy or first copy of the chargers and you have to use always the genuine products from the apple so even that can even if you use for savings of money or few bucks you will be using the first copy as well as second copy which can even make scenario even worse so it is suggest on use only the products that has been given from the apple itself so that you will not be having any charging kind of issues and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out